Hello and welcome back once again to Product Placement. So the final one in the line of replacement Kickstarters, at least for right now, is this one. Now you may be saying, Rev, you did that one already too. That's the very first one that came out in the White series. Or what I call the Kickstart Whites as opposed to Kickstart Knights. And because it has the little white slashy bit here, if I can focus it towards the camera. So the very first ones that came out had the white slash with the pink label like this. And a white slash with a yellow or orangish yellow label like this. And then they've since come out with three additional ones that came out around the time that the Kickstart uh, Midnight Grape came out. Which you would have seen back in my Kickstart Whites video. So you may be saying this looks familiar. You've already done the pink Kickstart White can. No, I haven't. Because the original pink Kickstart White can has been discontinued. And has been replaced with this, which is actually a little bit more of a purplish tone as opposed to the pink tone, but it does look identical to the other can. So again, bad marketing decision on the part of Mountain Dew and Kickstart by reusing color schemes on your can because people aren't going to realize their new items if they don't see your advertise. So this is Energizing Raspberry Citrus. I had looked up what the other one that it replaced was, but I cannot remember it right off the top of my head. I'll probably post a picture of it up here somewhere because I'll have to look it up after the video. Yeah, basically it's still made with coconut water, flavored sparkling juice beverage blended from concentrate with other natural flavors. So this has replaced the Kickstart White Pink and with a Kickstart White uh, maroon or mauveish color. So let's crack it open and give it a smell test and see what we think. That has absolutely no smell to it at all. Very, very faint, very faint hint of raspberry and again that chalky smell. But I seem to remember the first time they did the whites, they didn't have much smell to them either. It was all in the taste. So let's go ahead and take a drink of this and see what we think. Cheers. Well, honestly, so far out of the three of these that I've tried, between the white label, the mango lime, and now this, this is the one I like the most. It's a nice smooth consistency. It's not real bitter or tart or anything like that. It goes down real smooth, just like the first ones did because of the coconut water probably. Very, very faint hint of raspberry, and it has a little bit of tartness at the end, which is probably the citrus, because like I said, I'm getting, again, kind of that chalky mouth flavor, and I think that's with whatever they're using for the citrus flavoring in these. It doesn't taste like mango or uh, grapefruit like the other ones did, so I'm thinking maybe it's more orange-based or lemon-based. It's definitely not lime-based, because that, whatever lime they used in that other one, really puckered my senses real bad. Uh, this one is actually kind of smooth, but it still has that chalky aftertaste. How does it compare to the one it replaced? I honestly couldn't tell you because it's been forever since I had that one, and I would have to actually go back and rewatch that video to see what I thought of it and actually compare them. Like I said, overall, I kind of like it. It's not horrible. Out of the three that I've tried so far, it is definitely the best one. Now, as I said previously in, I think it was the Mango Lime video, that I am still looking for Mountain Dew Green Label which is out in select areas, but I've also been informed that there are other flavors coming out as well, or they're out in test market. I know of at least two of them that are out now, one, again, being the green label. Uh, the other one is called Mountain Dew Spiked, and there's two different flavors of Spiked. There's a raspberry limeade, I believe, and then a regular lemonade flavored one. And from my understanding is those are called spiked because they are flavored with cactus juice. So once I find green label and the two spiked ones, that'll be at least two more videos because I'll probably do the spiked together. And then there is another one that I saw on Mountain Dew's website or on the Wikipedia of upcoming flavors that's called Mountain Dew SA, which is a play on USA. Uh, so what it is, being a red, white, and blue can, is it's going to be a combination of Voltage, Code Red, and White Out, all mixed together for the Dew SA flavor. There is also a couple other test 
flavors out. Um, I'm sure you guys have heard of the Doritos flavor that's been tested for a while. That's going to be coming out later this year, along with another flavor that I forget off the top of my head. And then I think there is one more coming out pretty soon, along with the spiked ones, but I'm completely blanking out on what it's called. But if you really want to know, just go to Wikipedia and look up Mountain Dew flavors, and then just scroll down, and eventually you'll find the upcoming flavors. Those will be more episodes once they finally come out, once I'm able to get a hold of them. I am still looking for them because they are in select local locations i'm trying to see if there's any around here that i can go get if i can find them you'll see them soon if i can't then they'll probably have to wait for national release in which case you'll see everyone doing them yeah that's basically it for this episode again as always thank you guys for watching remember like comment subscribe share the video links are down in the description click the bell up here in the corner make sure you're getting notifications every time i post new content and until next time cheers